Hello everybody, welcome back to the Wade Farms YouTube. We have traction control off, you know what that means. Oh come on, I thought I'd be cranking more out of this pickup truck. I thought this thing would be doing better. Damn it. Oh, couldn't check for Posse. Do a little bit of rocking horses. Wow, this thing's a pretty pretty good performer. It's not overheating yet. Figured you gotta start the video off strong to do a quick little motor blow. So we're heating now. Let's see if we can do a still just do a burnout. One wheel peel, I like it. Coolant overheating, coolant overheating. Oh no! What's the interior look like? Got it. It's, it's getting hot. Holy crap! This thing's just this thing just keeps going, man. Bet somebody could still use this as a work truck. Uh oh. That's the bad. That's the bad smoke. All right, it's not even doing a burnout anymore. Uh oh. Gotta do some rocking horses, you know. Clean up its system a little bit. Alright, we might just need to do some redlining. That'll help it. Gotta mix up your engine oil when it's not uh when it's not running properly. Yeah, if you ever see that puffing smoke and then smoke coming out from the radiator, you need to just redline your engine. Maybe we'll neutral drop it. Oh, it's weak, folks. It's really weak. You can hear it just rev up. Oh yeah, it's locked. It's locked. Wow, that that took four minutes. Holy crap! That took a long time to lock this thing. Right, we got to do a little bit of off-roading right here. We got to lock in four-wheel drive. Oh, come on. Go climb up this. Oh, come on. You're stuck already? Right, I guess don't buy a standard pickup truck for off-roading. Actually, maybe. Just gotta help it a little bit. Help it a little bit more. All right, this thing didn't lock soon enough, so we gotta fix that. That was about five seconds. It's uh, it's pretty fast for locking an engine. We whip this thing around. Can't see anything out of the front windshield. We're also losing traction. We'll lock it in four-wheel drive. How about we do that? This thing's doing good. This thing's off-roading. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. We, we flipped it. Hey, that's all right. We'll just keep her going straight down the road. We'll hit this little jump right here. Oh, beautiful. Oh, this thing's really a uh, work of art. This thing's like a glowing piece of art right here. And we got a little trail? We don't like trails, so we go off of them. Ooh! Hey, we're good. We saved it. We saved it. Gotta keep this thing going straight on the road. 
Got a couple jumps. It's always good for the suspension. Oh, we tipped it. It's always good for your neck. All right, we'll tip it right back over. Right back over. Come on. Come on. High clutch temperature. Oh, don't give me that crap. Oh, come on. Right, it's good. So I started puffing a little bit of that uh, smoke, but it stopped now, so I think we're good. Oh, come on. Differential's already out like that. Wow, that was quick. This thing's lasting a lot longer than the pickup truck did. I don't think this thing can do no mercy reverses and uh, rocking horses and neutral drops, though. Well, we're on some flat land here, and if the trans... The, it's the high clutch temperature, you know. Probably got that anti... It's got, it's got a break in it, so it's not gonna... It's not gonna... I guess we just redline until done. Until dead. Oh, well, I can kind of see the temperature climbing a little bit. Well, it's climbing, maybe... A couple temperature on the clutch is still pretty high. To be honest, I don't think we can blow this engine, so gotta switch to something else. Say you're racing with uh, Doc Hudson, and you're looking at your phone because somebody just Snapchatted you or Instagrammed you or whatever. Oh God! And you go flying off the road. Will you be all right in a '60s car? All right. Yeah, I think you're good. I will do that a couple more times. That was fun. Oh, hit that tree. Perfect. I don't, honestly, we, we weren't going fast enough. This thing's acting like it has a four cylinder in it. There we go. We got some action going on. Ah, still not enough. All right, so this thing, uh, this thing really can't get damaged. But I know something that might be faster. We got the Dodge Charger. You can see the little reptile thingy right there. This thing. Hopefully we can launch over that tree line. Oh, traction control, seriously? Oh, this thing just breathing. Hey, that was better. The engine lock? The engine really locked from that. I don't believe it. Maybe we don't have to just redline it right away. It's in the ketchup right off the bat. Well, hey, at least this, uh, at least we're damaging a car that's worth $100,000, am I right? From the back, it might be a pigeon. When you look at the front, it's an 8.1 liter engine and a pigeon. All right, if this thing doesn't jump over that hill, honestly, I don't know it will. I don't think there's anything that would get over that hill. So you thought. Uh. Oh! oh! Holy crap. Oh my god. Holy crap, we did it. Kind of. Dude, it's a... 
It's crazy how fast this thing is. All right, we got this. Both hands on the wheel. Perfect jump. We're flying. Yes, we did it. We did it. We jumped over that. Let's go. Oh, wait. Hey, I have a new idea, a new boat. Boat that can carry 40 passengers and get from one side of the ocean to the other in under two minutes. Or not. Oh, hey, at least you get to see uh, some fish on your adventure. All right. You know we can't end the video without neutral dropping, rocking horse, and to end it a no mercy reversey in a taxi. All right, you know we gotta start off with some rocking horses. This thing already is ripping. It's a New York taxi, so you know she's got like 500 on the clock. You know, you've got the french fries under the seat, and the coffee stains. This thing just stills running like a clock. Wow, this thing's just... It just does an amazing job. Always performs. Let's see if we can do a quick burnout. Ho ho ho! Wow, that's impressive. Got a nice little one wheel peel, I think, is going on here. Oh, the coolant's starting to overheat. That's not a good sign. That's never a good sign. All right, so before we blow it up, you know we gotta do some neutral drops. Redline your engine. Down into drive. Oh, it's getting weak. Do a rocking horse real quick. Redline, drive. Rocking horse. Redline, drive. Oh, it's weak, folks. It's not performing. So say you're driving down the road, your engine's overheating, you're just trying to get home, right? Your kid is reaching up in the front seat and he's trying to grab onto your Coca-Cola. And you're like, hey, stop that. And he accidentally knocks it into reverse. I bet your car won't survive that. But I know this car can. Or your son buys a $500 taxi. It's not running well. And he's out with his friends. And he wants to do some Rockfords. Well, you know this car is going to do it. Oh, yeah. How your son learns. No mercy reversi. Perfectly fine. If I do some rocking horses to finish this thing off. Alright, it's weak. Gotta red line it. Right into the ketchup. Let's see if we can get that on the dash. Right into the ketchup. That's really nice. And she's done! Wow! Thing performed excellent i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure you guys like subscribe to the bell post notifications i know it might not have been as good as all the other beam and g drive videos but i still hope you enjoyed it we will catch you guys next time we farm